Hey there folks and welcome back to the I Am CDB project. I of course am your host CDB. You are not and today we are going to use the Razor Rock Game Changer with the 0.84 um, blade gap. The original plate had the 0.68 uh, blade gap and this one is a 0.84 and I have used it through the week and I'll give you my thoughts on it. Very, very good. I'll tell you that at the beginning. We're also going to be using the Monster Monster uh, Razor Rock F400 brush, which is 34 millimeter. The inspector uh, gave me this when I was took a trip last year to um, New Jersey, and it is an incredible brush at the price. It's $24.99, and it is massive, and it's got a great knot, and I'll tell you what it's great for as I'm using it. We're also going to be using some Razor Rock 1X, so pretty much Razor Rock across the board today. So I'm going to go ahead and wet my uh, F 400 and one of the things this, this uh, brush is great for is making a lather quickly because there is so much surface area on this brush it just whips up a lather like no one's business uh, i did not have any lather in this bowl at the start of the video i wanted to make a lather um, deliberately while i'm talking to you and as you can see i'm already starting to build a lather i have to hold it low here because this camera is up a good ways and i'm not used to lathering uh, that high up but at any rate this thing with this massive surface area really uh, whips up a lather rather quickly if you were concerned about uh, making a lather quickly like a bow lather or even you could use it as a face lather if you wanted to it's just such a massive brush that it does a great job um, to the razor rock game changer plate uh, it's still incredibly smooth. I'll talk about it during the course of the shave. That was my one concern. The 6.8 was just so smooth, silky, silky smooth. I worried that the 0.84 might feel a more, little more harsh, and thus far, that has not been the case. So let me go ahead and get some water here and wet the face down. I hope everyone is doing well this Saturday morning, or I don't know what time I'll actually post this, but it's Saturday morning at the time of shooting anyway and let's see what we can do here with this Razor Rock 1X. As you can see this this brush is massive. I mean it is quite a brush and where I really like it is for head lathering because you can get like a quarter of your head just by you know making a few swipes with the brush. It is it is quite an amazing brush at the price, I think. Uh, I don't see a lot of people using them, but if you're in the market for a uh, for a large brush, I say give it a shot. I can't really tell much about my leather because the mirror behind me there is a good ways back from where I'm standing, so I'm only using the, the camera on this video, which of course is my phone. It's not that big, so it's, sometimes it's hard for me to tell what our leather is looking like, but I'm sure it will be adequate for the job today. Okay, let's put the brush in there. Just sort of wipe myself off because I've got lather all over the place, down the neck, run, run, running everywhere. Let's cut that back a little bit and wipe my shirt off. And we will start using this uh, very, very nice Razor Rock Game Changer with the Point eighty four plate, and you can feel the uh, aggression, but it is extremely smooth. So you can definitely tell it's a little more efficient. But honestly, if you put the plates, you know, side by side, I think they're pretty close to equal on being smooth, which is really the most important thing to me. I don't mind if an if a razor is aggressive, so long as it's smooth. That's the key. For me, it needs to be smooth, and uh, this razor is quite smooth, and the plate, I believe, was sold for $29.99. I don't think they have any right now. They typically sell out. Uh, the full razor, I think, was sold for $49.99. Of course, I already had the Game Changer razor. I just got the plate because I wanted to try it with a, nut, with a little more efficiency, and I really like it, so... If you got the Game Changer previously and you said, you know, it's really nice, but I think I'd want a little more um, 
efficiency, then uh, grab that plate next time uh, you see them uh, online. And they do tend to go fast, so your best bet is generally to either follow Italian Barber on uh, Instagram or Twitter and set notifications so it'll pop up when he posts something. And he typically, typically posts it on those platforms when he releases them and then they go shortly thereafter. So uh, just check that out if you are interested. And boy, let me tell you, this is a massive, massive brush. Maybe even too big for some people, but if you just wanna cover a lot of surface area quickly, uh, it's a really outstanding brush. And like I said, I think it really shines when you're uh, face lathering. I love this 1X soap and scent, by the way. It's a really a tremendous scent. It's it's uh, There's another soap that's like it. Um, it's called Colder Soapworks Puro Frescos. It smells very similar to this one. This is just a very, in my view, clean, refreshing type of scent. And it's uh, very good stuff. So let's get on with Pass number two, again, I hope everyone is doing well this uh, Saturday morning. I'm doing well. I've, uh, I, by the way, I put up a uh, video this morning uh, when I was coming home from work the other day. I shot a uh, fasting update because I've had a lot of questions about uh, fasting and where I am with that. So if you're interested in that, go check it out. And of course, if you're not, that's all. Well and good, no worries whatsoever. But if you're interested in intermittent fasting, in my experience thus far, having done it since about uh, February, um, go check that out. I published that this morning, and uh, I don't want to, you know, blabber on about it too much during the course of this video. But I did make that video for you all to check out if you are so inclined. Okay. Smooth razor here, folks. That's the one thing I think uh, Italian Barber and Razor Rock really got it right when they made this razor. This is one of my uh, favorite razors, and it comes at a very, very good price. Now, this handle came with the, uh, I believe it came with the Mamba razor, and I just kept it. It was one of their Halo handles, and I love it. Uh, I did not use the handle that came with this particular razor. I prefer the, the Mamba handle but that's just me. They uh, generally have a lot of handle options, so just sort of be on the lookout for those. All right, let's just add a little more moisture here. And we're really trucking along here this morning. And look at this, uh, ah, you never can see it in the light, but there's a substantial amount of lather in that bowl. Let's go ahead and get on with our third and final pass this knot really is soft too it's 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 very big but it's very soft it, it might be really good for perhaps a also a lady shaving her legs because there's you know you don't really have to worry about getting it on other things and you cover a lot of surface area at one time and like i said before it's also very good for uh for head which i'll demonstrate when i do my head shave here just right following this video. Of course, the head shaving video I usually post a little later in the day for those of you who appreciate uh, head shaving videos. And those are usually head shavers, <laughs> folks who like to shave their head or just want to shave their head or, or what have you. So if you're part of that club, stay tuned. We'll do one of those. I try to at least do one a week, one head shave video, because. There are people who like those, and thank you for watching, and thank those of you who just watch these videos and, and the other stuff that I've put up over the years as well. I really do appreciate it. It certainly means a lot. And this razor has done a really great job, I'll tell you that. Really smooth, and that's that's what I really like about it. it this one is, uh, it really doesn't feel that much more Aggressive, but it is. You can tell. There certainly is a difference. Uh, for me, it's just right. It's just right. It just really uh, hits the spot. Feels fantastic and does a 
what I feel is a very good job of uh, being efficient while smooth and uh, being smooth both in blades and razors is really paramount to me. If you're not smooth, I don't want to fool with you, you know. And so, this one really manages to hit the spot on those fronts. And this Razor Rock uh, 1X has some decent residual slickness. You see that razor just sort of gliding along without, you know, sticking, rubbing, so forth, which is great. And that's really just a really nice, relatively quick shave. Let me go ahead and uh, rinse, and then we'll come back and do the post for you. Stay tuned. All right, and here we are at the Magic Made by Witches. I almost said Magic Made by Thayers. It is Magic Made by Thayers, I guess. Thayers Witch Hazel, which you see here. And we'll slap that on. And that feels fantastic. And while that sets for just a second, we'll talk about what we used. Razor Rock Game Changer with the .84 plate. Very, very good. Verdict is two thumbs up on that. Um, it retains its smoothness, smoothness while being a little more efficient, which is great for me. Razor Rock F400, an absolute beast of a brush at $24.99. And you can get it with the stand if you want. Of course, the price, I don't know what the price is with the stand, but without it, it's, I think, $24.99-ish, somewhere thereabouts. If I'm wrong, don't sue me. Um, and, of course, my Timeless Bowl, which is fantastic. And we will, uh, oh, I almost forgot the soap. Razor, Razor Rock 1X, which is a really nice scent. And we'll finish it off with a little Razor Rock 1X aftershave, which is great stuff in my estimation. A little 1X, which will cheer us up during our head shave. Not that we need to be cheered up because we love shaving the dome. I want to thank everybody for joining me, uh, not only for this video, but for all the videos. I really do appreciate it. Until next time, I've been your host, CDB. You are not. God bless.